It's time to go to Spike Town. Yes. Oh my God, I love hitting. Hitting is so awesome. The only thing better than hitting is blocking. Ah, I'm an American. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to learn how to do an approach, okay? The most important steps of your approach are the last two. Okay, what are the most important steps of your approach? All right, so when I refer to an approach, I'm always going to talk in the context of four steps. Okay, some of you guys may have a three-step approach. Um, let, let's just talk in context of a four-step approach. Okay, but again, what's the most important? I forgot. Okay, in terms of percentage, I would say your last two steps are 90% of the importance of your approach. The first two are really just to get the motor going. I call the last two steps step close. Everyone say step close. Step close. Okay, do we have any lefties here? Any weird people lefties? Okay, that's all right. So everything I say is just going to be backwards, and you've heard that a million times, right? Okay, awesome. So when we do our step close, okay, so let's just say I'm on my left, so I'm on my second step, and I'm about to do my last two. So can everyone go ahead and get on their third step? Spread out just a little bit. Let's hang over our third step. Okay, which for the normal people, the right-handers. <laughs> okay, it's gonna be your left. Okay, and when we take our last two steps, we are going to step to where the set is, and then we are going to close our body to the net. Okay? Okay, let's rewind again. Okay, so you're on your second step. Okay, and we're gonna get into the most important two steps of your approach with our last two. Okay, wherever we read that it said is going to be, we are going to step to it. Okay, and then we are going to close our body. Okay, so a couple questions here. Okay, why do we want to step to wherever the set is? Raise your hand. Why? Yes. Yeah, you get your feet to the ball. You have good body position. Okay. How many people here have only seen perfect sets their entire life? Okay, now I want to recruit that kid. Who's your setter? Okay. No one has. Not even on the Olympic team do the setters have perfect sets all the time. So we're going to have to adjust. Okay? And which is okay. Right? Because as passers, we don't have perfect passes all the time. So we're not going to have perfect sets all the time, which is okay. All right? So you're going to have to adjust every single time to the set. So our adjustment step is going to be our third step. Okay, so we're going to step to wherever that set takes us, whether it's wide, whether it's inside, whether it's off the net, tight, whatever it is. Okay, that's going to be our third step. Okay, why do we close our body off with our fourth step? Why? Anyone? Yes. McKenna, right? Gosh, I'm good with names. Yes? So you can use torque. Oh my gosh, she's transferring ideas that we learned early on in the session. It's amazing. Okay, so we can use our torque. She's setting herself up by opening her hips. Okay, why else? Yes. So you can like stay out of the net. You so you can stay out of the net, right? We don't want to be a bunch of fish. Okay, if my toes are pointing towards the net and I'm jumping this way, where am I going to continue to go? Forward, right? Where do I want to go in volleyball? Up, right? It's a vertical game. All right, it's not how far you can broad jump. It's how high you can jump. Okay, so you need to stop your body's momentum, okay, by closing off your step. Okay, so let's go ahead, let's get back into our third, or sorry, get back into your second step. So for us normal people, right-handers, we're going to be on our left, okay? So from our left, okay, let's stick our hands out in front, just nice, old, relax them out here. Okay, we're going to step, and then I want you to close. Okay, awesome, rewind. Go back to your left. Okay, let's say that the setter drops the set inside. Okay, so we're gonna go from here, everyone hands out, over your left. Okay, let's say the setter drops the ball inside. Now we're gonna step inside and then close. Okay, awesome, rewind. Let's say our setter, okay, doesn't take the ball neutral. She takes it out in front a little too much and she, she hangs it wide. Okay, so we're here. Okay, we're gonna go step wide and then close. Okay, awesome job. Okay, so that's the concept behind it. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to start out with the hardest and then we're going to make it easier. Okay, I need a couple of demos to, to jump and swing with me. Okay, Larissa and Niaz, okay. What we're going to do is we're going to toss the ball, okay, while we're on our left 
And then we are going to step close and we're going to jump and swing. And we're going to do it right around the 10 foot line. Here, you can have a ball. Okay, so let's go ahead and stick. Are you guys both uh, right handed? Yeah. Okay, so go ahead and stick your left out in front. Okay, so as you start to move forward on your left, I want you to toss out in front of you, okay, about antenna height. And then I want you to step, close, jump, and swing. Okay, just one at a time. Okay. Awesome. That was great. With all the pressure in the world, too. Okay. Okay, good. You can give yourself, let's try it again. Give yourself a higher toss. Start on your left, and then transfer your weight, toss. Awesome. That's exactly what I want, okay? And what we're gonna do is we're gonna work on our last two steps. So I've eliminated the first two, right? Because we're already starting on our, on our second step. Okay, we're gonna toss out in front of us. Wherever we toss, no one's a perfect tosser, right? We didn't get a tossing camp, okay? So wherever that toss leads us to, we gotta step that way. And then I want us to focus on closing. Okay, going up, jump and swing, okay? Using our torque. Okay, and using our whip and contacting the ball with the full extension. Does everyone understand? Okay, so the way this drill is gonna work out, we're gonna have three groups. Okay, we'll have three groups on three courts. Okay, so we'll have about four people per group. So we'll have a group that's swinging, okay, back on the 10 foot line. We'll have a group that's gonna feed them from the other side of the net, and then we'll have shaggers on the far side. Okay, the shaggers are gonna give the ball to the feeders, and the feeders are going to hand the ball to the hitters. So we shouldn't have any balls rolling around here. Okay, so we're gonna work on a self toss to a step close. Okay, so we'll have you four are gonna be uh, attacking first. Okay, one, two, three. You guys are gonna be the shaggers. Okay, you guys are gonna be the four along the net feeding. You guys got it? Okay, awesome. So let's see how we had this set up. Okay, let's like, give me one, two, give me one more here. Okay, you guys are back shagging. Okay, one, two, three, four. Can I have one person shagging? Can I have you over here feeding underneath the side of that? Good, so there's gonna be three groups. Okay, you guys are the, the hitters. Okay, awesome. Okay, great job. Okay, go ahead ladies. You only get two steps, ladies. Start on your left. You only get two steps. A step and a close, that's it. That's all you get. You only get two steps to get to the ball. Oh, watch, yeah, watch the ball. Give yourself a nice higher toss. Okay, higher toss. Okay, good, 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 good. That's better, that's better. You only get two steps, no tap dancing. Good, a step and a close. Okay, good, but you're tossing with the wrong hand. That's really good. Just make sure you have your clothes. Okay, because you're flat right now. Like this. So it's step and then really close that last step. Okay. That's better. That is a lot better. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So you're just going to toss with your right. So okay. go ahead and get your left leg here. And as you lean over, toss. One, two. Okay, step close. Okay, good. You can toss it higher though. You're making it harder on yourself. <laughs> yes, that is good. That is good. That is good. So if you were just shagging on the far wall, then you are now hitting. Okay, if you were hitting, you are now a feeder. If you are a feeder, you are now shagging. Who else was shagging? Anyone? Okay, that's it. Why not? Why not? Jump in. Okay, so you want to toss to the right. So, so, so start on your left like this, then as you start to put more weight on it, that's when you toss. One, two, up and swing. Okay. Yeah, you just got to toss out in front so you can step close. Okay, good. So you, both of your feet are pointing towards the net on your, on your step close. So it's got to be step, close off your body. Yeah, good, 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 a lot better.
You only get two steps, ladies. You only get two steps. Start on your left. Toss with your right. 